Hello, this is me, Christine. Welcome back to my channel. So, today I wanted to talk about my monthly favorites in February. Um, I have done quite a lot of shopping, which I don't usually do, so let's get into it. And first of all, I would want to start with my clothing favorite, which are these jeans. I needed a lot of jeans because I run out of all of them. Well, basically not run out of them, just well, basically or how to say it. Um, so these are one of them which I bought, and they are diesel jeans. And why I wanted to mention them in this video is also because it was a huge bargain. Uh, originally, they cost like one hundred sixty euros, I believe. And uh, I bought them for 55 euros, so it was a good bargain. I really like them. I love them. I love how they fit. And dark denim has always been my favorite. It looks good in like classical uh, days, like going to work, and uh, also also in just daily life and going out with friends or whatever. Um. The only bad and actually horrible thing about this is that they stain and color my tights basically with like in like dark blue color which is like awful and uh, I think for such a money especially if they were originally for like 160 euros then they shouldn't do that and I bought similar pants in Zara for like 22 euros and they don't, uh, they don't leave any kind of color on my, on my tights and everything. So, um, that's really a bad thing in the, for this. But otherwise, they are quite good. I like them. Uh, and now I want to continue with makeup because that's what all this channel is all about, or will be at least. So I want to start with L'Oreal True Match Powder, which looks like this, uh, if you can see, and it's the first time I have tried L'Oreal powders, and usually I tried Max Factor and Maybelline, which I really liked. Uh, actually, if you would ask me which uh, drugstore brand is my favorite, then I think I would say Maybelline, but L'Oreal has some pretty cute stuff as well. So, yeah, I took it in shade Vanilla Rosé, or Rose Vanilla. Uh, my skin is really, really light. You can probably tell it. You know, it's like light, it's not so good, but yeah. Believe me, it is pretty light. So what I like about this powder as well, that it looks like there is just a powder and nothing. But actually, underneath it, there is... A little sponge, which I actually don't really use, and a mirror, which is I think really awesome. Yeah, there you can see my phone, yay! So, yeah, I really like that. Um, so good purchase. Uh, another L'Oreal product, which is my favorite lip product this month, is this plum kind of colory, like ancient. Oh, it's so difficult to see in this lightning. It's like ancient plum burgundy kind of color. Um, in general, I love the this L'Oreal palette. It's in color five hundred multi mal ray, and it's really, really, really beautiful and glossy. So I have a few other colors as well. Um, but this I find the prettiest for exact this period of time and it's like kind of wintry spring kind of period. So yeah, this is good as well. As for my favorite uh, eye product, I kind of decided to cheat and choose two. Two because Dior is my actual favorite, but I have just mentioned in my blog post all over again this last month or two. So that's why I'm like, um, this, yeah, the ones who are reading my blog maybe are too tired to hear me talking about this all the time. But 
this mascara is absolutely the best I have ever used I think and the brush looks like this like this this yeah and uh, yeah there's just nothing else to say about it I guess I have always been using like drugstore uh, drugstore mascaras like Maybelline and L'Oreal and they are not bad they are really really good like basically for Maybelline I think I have like I have loved everyone I have used um but well if you if your budget allows to spend more money on mascara then I think this is a good option so yeah this is about that and the other eye product favorite is this art deco eyebrow pencil which is uh, I try to find some kind of oh yeah number one <laughs> so this is number one eyebrow pencil it's kind of like like light brown oh looks like this uh, it doesn't smudge like so much like when you put on and then after a while it just has moved somewhere or like it's not too uh, it's not too soft and not so so hard as well like oh i i before this one i bought uh, from essence like eyebrow pencil yeah it was just so hard like when you draw on the arm it's like okay but when you want to draw it on actual eyebrow it just makes like it feels like i could act i should actually like cut it to like see any color on it it was just so horrible so i basically run to the store as soon as i could and was searching for a new eyebrow pencil and the lady suggested me this one because i actually wanted to buy a mac one i think yeah but they didn't have any mac which was really weird so i was like okay i'll try this out and i really love it so yeah oh and it has a brush which i actually really like yeah so that's about that um uh, then i have my body product kind of favorite i don't know how to call it right but um this is this body cream which is like yeah body butter body butter yeah anyway this is from body shop and i just love their body butters they are just the best especially the scent of it they last really long as well and they just oh, it's just so that's at least the scent of it is special for, for his body butter so yeah i think so far i have had strawberry one and and something which i don't remember anymore like coconut maybe if they have something like that then i have had that but this one i think is the best really the scent is like like awesome and yeah it's just really really small scent and yeah so and which goes for like perfume scent kind of stuff my favorite this month is this Victoria's Secret perfume or fragrance mist which is like which is this one it's called passion struck and it has fuji apple and vanilla or orchid do you say orchid i hope you say orchid scent to it and it is just so so nice and deliciously scented that it's just freaks me out yeah and i use it usually on the, in the morning before running to work it's just like just that thing you put it on and you're ready to go and you don't need anything else so i'm loving this one i really agree i really advise to and the last but not least is my hair product and oh geez guys you'll probably understand after some videos or something that uh, my hair are absolutely horrible if i don't do anything with them so i need the best products i'm always trying to find the best of the best um 
which goes for hair products basically whatever it is shampoos conditioners masks oh yeah i know girl, there are girls who are using masks like every third time washing or anything like that i'm basically using it every single time because otherwise i just can't deal with them it's just way too much to handle Whew. yeah um other thing is i definitely use oil afterwards after washing my hair because they just are crazy basically they're out of their mind they go wherever they want they just look like this like i look like a poodle usually and uh, yeah, so basically, that's why I need to do something with them every single time. I want them to look good. Um, so yeah, my hair product, which I even forgot to mention, is this Kardashian Beauty Dry Shampoo. Looks like this. And I haven't really tried dry, dry, dry conditioner before, like at all. I'm not talking even about Kardashian one. So I don't know about how those work. Like it, I even when I heard it, I was like, what is that? Yeah, but I love this one. It doesn't stick too much. It's like really nice, but don't use it too much, of course, as every dry shampoo. Uh, but I really love it, and it even smells good, I think. So it's kind of as good as it can smell. Uh, so yeah, I've been loving this one because I can't really like, wash my hair every single day um because first of all if i hear it's not even so healthy uh otherwise i said the reason before because i always need to straighten them or curl them or do whatever to them so it's just i can't do it every single day because i am busy sometimes so yeah i, mean, I used to do my hair like a few times a week that's why I'm doing that really good with masks and conditioners and oils afterwards and all the products I can I will use in my hair basically to keep them together. So yeah, that's my horrible horror story of my hair. So uh, hopefully you liked my kind of first video of my beauty beauty channel and um, have a nice day and see you guys tomorrow. Bye.